Hey guys, if you can see me, I'm right here. The camera is placed about five or six feet away from me. And if still you guys can hear me talking, it's because of a small technical marvel. It goes by the name Rode Wireless Go. All right, this review is about the Rode Wireless Go, which the company claims to be the most versatile and the most compact wireless microphone system available on the market right now. A quick disclaimer that Rode hasn't paid me to do this review. Uh, they haven't sent me the product. I bought this uh, mic myself and I'm going to do an honest review about it. Stay tuned in. Coming up. Welcome back to the channel. This is AW Pixotica back with a bang for you guys. All right, if you are new here, consider subscribing, turn on those bell notification icons and do leave a like on this video. That is really gonna help my channel grow. Let's see what's inside the box. So once you open the box, you get two parts, one transmitter and the other is a receiver. You get two USB type C cables for charging this system. You get an instruction manual, you get two tiny dead cats and a carrying pouch, plus some silica gel to keep the things dry. That's pretty much it what's inside the box. Once we talk about the receiver on this thing, the receiver uh, has a colored LCD screen which allows you to see the signal strength, the decibels on which you're working and the battery life. The receiver also has a quick pairing button, a button to control the decibels uh, on the device and a 3.5 millimeter TRS jack to connect it on the camera system which you're using, plus a USB type C charging port which charges the receiver. When you talk about the transmitter, on the transmitter you get a USB type C charging port, two indicators, one for the battery and one for the pairing. Both are colored red and an internal built-in microphone which is the highlight of this uh, wireless mic over here. You get a 3.5 millimeter TRS jack uh, on which you can attach external level air mics or any other standard mic that you want to use with this. Both the transmitter and the receiver have a clip on uh, system which allows it which allows you to place the receiver uh, onto your camera's hot shoe or cold shoe mount through the clip. It's pretty easy to clip both the transmitter and receiver the way you want and wherever you want. Let's talk about a few features that the company, company is giving us on the Rode Wireless Go microphone system. It has seven hours of battery life on one charge and there's a built-in battery inside this microphone which allows you to be flexible. This microphone system can also be charged uh, externally using a power bank or any other external charging source while on the use. Another feature that the company is offering is a range of 250 feet which is close to 70 meters. My God, this is an awesome range. So you get the flexibility to move around and shoot in areas, in urban areas where you're trying to film, you know, from a distance, you're trying to film things. A range of 70 meters is all that I needed. It gives me all the flexibility to move around while I'm shooting and not being worried about loss of signal or any stuff like that. Now the system uses a 2.4 gigahertz uh, transmission frequency, which is a sweet thing. When we talk about the performance on uh, this tiny microphone system, it performs like a beast. Trust me, it performs really nice. The sound quality is so amazing, so amazing coming out of this mic alone. I haven't used a Levelia as of yet. I'm using the internal microphone system available inside the transmitter on my wireless go system. Now the range that I talked about earlier, 250 feet or 70 meters is a range that gives you the flexibility to move around and shoot in difficult situations without worrying about the signal dropping or the sound quality dropping. The only thing that you need to take care of is the line of sight. Now this microphone system works on the principle of line of sight. So if there is an object that is obstructing you or the transmitter and the receiver, there's going to be a drop in the signal. So you don't want that. Just keep your line of sight straight. Make sure there are no obstructions between you and the receiver on the camera. And there you go. The little clips on the transmitter and the receiver 
are a lifesaver. You can literally clip it on your pocket, you can clip it on a jacket or a hoodie or anything else. Plus, the clip on the receiver is compatible with all the hot or cold shoes available on Canon and Nikon cameras and of course, Sony cameras are there, so it's a handy thing to have. The simplistic design and ease of use are the two things that prompted me to go for the wireless microphone system, the Rode Wireless Go. It's very, very simple to use. Just clip the receiver onto the camera, put in a TRS cable, attach the cable inside your microphone jack in the camera, take the transmitter, clip it onto your jacket or sweater, whatever you're wearing, switch both on, they're going to pair in like two seconds, and there you go, you're ready to shoot. That's, that's it, that's it for this microphone system. It's very, very convenient to use, and plus the range it's giving. Now the built-in mic that the company is giving inside the transmitter is a lifesaver. If you are not willing to use a lavalier and you have to, you know you have a long wire you can attach the transmitter on the side of your pocket of your trousers or your belt you're gonna have to use a cable cable is gonna come from underneath your t-shirt and up here somewhere you're gonna get the attachment and stuff like that I don't do that I use the internal microphone which is already available on the transmitter and trust me it's a lifesaver the sound quality the transmission the crispness the depth inside the sound is amazing it's really good in the end, I would just like to conclude by saying a few words that uh, this microphone system costs anywhere between 200 to 250 uh, US dollars, which is, trust me, not heavy in the pocket at all. You must own it. This is uh, a wireless system for, you know, run and gun photographers and videographers and bloggers out there who are new to YouTube. You'll love the flexibility that the wireless system or the wireless capability this uh, mic offers you won't have to worry about the distance between you and the camera whether the sound system is actually recording or not this is such a versatile piece of thing that you can attach it with any external audio recording source and plug that inside your camera and do do a lot of other things with it it's beautifully designed uh, the light and the LCD system, the, uh, the colored LCD that it comes with, the belt quality, the make, and plus the size of this thing. It's like this tiny. All these things are plus points. However, what prompted me to go for this mic was the wireless connectivity, the range of 70 meters, uh, the ease of use and simplicity of design and simplicity of use. I absolutely adore and love it. Road well done, good job done. Uh, I hope this video is going to help you choose your next wireless microphone system out there. Kudos to uh, Rode for making such a nice and neat tech gadget for us vloggers and video uh, vloggers, videographers and YouTubers out here. In the end, I would just like to say that if you guys are new to the channel, do leave a like, do subscribe and turn on those bell notification icons if you haven't done so already. This is Ali from AWP Exotica. I'll be coming up with a lot of new videos uh, really, really soon. I'm trying to bring you guys a review of the DJI Mini 2. I'm waiting for it to arrive in my home and I'll unpack it and, you know, get you the review. That's pretty much it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Do leave in the comment section below if you want anything of your choice to be displayed or made over here. Stay tuned and for future videos. Take care. Bye-bye.